Um, I suppose there's always going to be something I forget. The experiences are just too vast. Um, but I certainly have sort of echoed the way in which it works, even when I go back to when I was a little kid. Um, I can't be what you are. And I'm not even going to try. Uh, because you have within your own right, just like a bird that's up on a branch, a fish that's in a river, okay? I'm not what you are. I'm, a, I'm observing in my mirror the love that I have for everything that I'm experiencing that is in that mirror. Okay? So that you get to know who I am, which loves you. Okay, so now you know from which creation began. And they will acknowledge that because they will acknowledge being loved. So it's like being loved by your creator. So when you're giving love to all creator, then everything that is in creation is experiencing the grant, the first creator, the engine of love. Because that's what it began with. And when you're not experiencing that as a result of what others do to you, then they have to return to fire. Because love is the hottest engine that's on fire. That's the purity of that light, which is the purity of that fire that will cleanse uncleanliness and those that break the law, which is a broken arrow, which is a broken sphere, which is a broken soul, which is a fragmented soul, which is a broken heart, which is where pain and suffering come from. And that's what results in war between all the children. That's why we don't seek to control anything. Because how are you going to experience what love is if we're trying to control you? Love is a free spirit. That spirit is a teacher. When that spirit is purified through fire that is in that light, you're experiencing the purest of love. That's who I am. That's who we are. We're the law. That's why we're here. We're cleaning this mess up. Have a great day. Be good to yourselves.